Hi Pisces, it's Be Divine and welcome to Divine Miracles. This is going to be a crystal forecast for 2020, just focusing on career, finances, love and relationships. Very, very quick rundown using my little crystal kit. Don't forget, um, I've made a video on how to give crystal readings. Go ahead and you can go ahead and search for that. Um, and it will show you how to get started yourself. This might be a new talent of yours, something that you're really in tune with since Pisces are the most psychic of all anyway. You might as well be doing some of that work, <laughs> if not having it as part of your life. This is our representation stones. So this is representing Pisces. Don't forget um, to look at your moon and rising sign. Okay. So this is, again, just very, very quick. I'm going to focus on first uh, career for Pisces 2020 energy see what comes up okay oh I always take notice of crystals that fall out this little crystal fell out okay so I'm gonna leave it back behind you remember this is you Pisces okay this is about Korea for 2020 now for Pisces a few things are in the background now and that's good okay so it's maybe some different ventures that you wanted to take up and it, it wasn't really gonna get you anywhere so it was a good thing that it kind of left okay but there are five things for Pisces that you need to focus on with regards to your career things that are creative for you things that have an emotional fulfillment for you is very very important okay if you're not doing something that you love you are going to feel so depressed you're going to feel so tired all the time and you're just going to be working against the grain when you're working and you're helping people you love doing that okay so your focus for your career has to be on something that's going to give people healing or give people hope or give people um, help in some way but it's also something that you really love doing so don't ignore any talents that you already have okay so some people are not interested in career because they're already retired but your career can mean what you do on a daily basis and your best energy is spent on helping other people and also seeing yourself as worth you know uh, like worth receiving not that you have to give all the time okay the energy for Pisces is not about giving of yourself all the time although you like doing that it can lead into a, a energy of I must give I'm not worth receiving so you need to allow yourself to receive career wise uh, you know whatever that means for you in 2020 letting go of there's actually quite a lot of letting go in 2020 even even now as we speak okay uh, there's Pisces all right now love and relationships for Pisces okay what's happening for love and relationships oh made me want to really shuffle these <laughs> okay Pisces you definitely have look look there's these connections here of love okay you definitely have a supportive and loving base surrounding you for 2020 if there's somebody that you want to commit with this could be this could be the time there's definitely love and support around you and maybe unsuspecting um, support as well I am really getting that feeling for Pisces that those that you thought might have been distant from you or uh, not in your life anymore start to come forward because when someone sees a change in somebody they want to know what it's all about if there's someone around that's been very controlling of you Pisces they're gonna to want to know what you're up to and like try to make you feel guilty about maybe you haven't answered them in a while or you haven't spoken to them in a while or whatever it is they may make it an appearance in uh, 2020 you have to stay strong okay because part of you is going to feel sorry for the energy or sorry for the person or maybe their circumstances someone's passed away or something's happened you know you're going to feel sad about that so the energy here is that you're not you know you're seeing things for what they are 
don't let people worm their way back in because you're on a high and you're doing things and you're working things out and you're feeling abundant and you're feeling happy you know these people that weren't there for you you know in the past really don't deserve to be a part of your success and your future you know they just want to be because they feel like they're missing out on something so be aware of manipulative energy okay guess i don't have to say it in that way for 2020 making sure that you're sticking to your guns because people are going to come forward when they see you out there and about and doing things right so in relationships also there are people coming from a distance to see you and it's going to bring a lot of peace into your heart as well uh, if you feel like committing to a certain person or a certain situation you definitely should because the energy of love of, of the rose quartz um, of deeper love is there with you okay now finances let's have a look Pisces remember this is representing you keep seeing the squirrel outside listening to me talking doing the videos <laughs> Pisces finances oh wow okay so you don't have to worry about your finances definitely at all because all of this energy is coming at you especially right here in the front so this is very close to you to me that's how i'm seeing it at this point it changes <laughs> i can see this completely different another time i do it but all this energy is pushing towards you right now with regards to your finances um emotion is a basis for your financial success so may, maybe someone that you're involved with is uh, strong and emotional or has an emotional impact on your in your life and that is what the success is with regards to financial stuff um, many many projects happening many many creative and spiritual experiences that are happening um, but something from the past is turning away from you which opens the door for your finances to come through so something that you were holding on to in the past um, or something that you were paying for or something that was draining you out energetically financially emotionally is leaving okay something gets overturned something gets changed here and it leads you open to your financial success which is all over the place okay it's all there for you you have solid foundation so make sure that you're staying very very positive as you move into 2020 about your finance don't get yourself caught up in your head remember to remain in your heart which is where all of the source energy is your head is just going to keep you going around in circles it's not going to solve anything by thinking overthinking is not solved by overthinking <laughs> okay so just be aware of that as well now i want to thank you all for listening if you need something more in depth please check out my website divinemiracles.com lots of love and bye for now bye